What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt DeVille with Counter Punch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Deontay Wilder, Anthony Joshua. Get this. According to Skills Challenge, that the Deontay Wilder versus Anthony Joshua fight is off and never was on for December in the first place. Wow. Despite reports for several weeks stating that Wilder versus Joshua is a done deal or that an offer has been made for the fight, World Boxing News can confirm none of it is set in stone. It says boxing is very uh, is, is a very fragmented sport. You have the biggest fights. The best fights can't be made because of network obligations, because of promoters clashing, managers clashing, and sanctioning bodies. But the fight was never on. There have been talks, but nothing is confirmed. And let me counterpunch. First of all, why did it take Skills Challenge so long to get back with us with this information that was going out? For one. For two, why are you saying the fight is off if you guys are still talking? That's a red flag for me. When you say the fight is off versus no, nothing has been said, you might could, you might as well say, well, whoa, whoa, back up. We haven't had anything confirmed yet. But to say the fight is off the way they worded it, you know, and they're basing it off of what network obligations and clashing of promoters and managers and shit like that. I think for the most part, that should have been already said. Okay. But one thing is for clear that they are making it very, very clear that Anthony Joshua versus Deontay Wilder was never on for December. Yes, they signed all Alexander Usyk, but even the Alexander Usyk versus Tyson Fury fight doesn't mean anything. What does it really mean? That means somebody's going to get paid a shitload of money to fight other people that we don't want to see. That's what it seems like to me. Bars. That's what I say. You know, and if anything, I think that Deontay Wilder and Anthony Joshua was the saving grace of this heavyweight boxing extravaganza, okay? I think if, if we couldn't get Tyson Fury versus Alexander Usyk, we could have at least got Deontay Wilder versus Anthony Joshua because that's just like the Terrence Crawford, Errol Spence situation. It should have been happened, but it hasn't. So at least we're getting Crawford versus Terrence Craw uh, uh, Errol Spence, right? But in the heavyweight division, we're seeing too much of this. You know, these guys are supposed to know everything. are supposed to have their people in, you know. But I guess better later than sooner because we were thinking that that was a done deal. That's why Wilder was trying to pick a person to fight. Well, Joshua was actually fighting again in, in, in August against whoever, right? It's supposed to be Dillian White. But now we don't know anything. And now Skills Challenge looks like they're backing out. Maybe, just maybe based on what Tyson Fury's doing over there and his daddy saying, well, what they won't do and they want an apology and they want to be, uh, they, they want uh, him to explain himself and all this stuff for running out on negotiations of before and all this, that, and the other, where Tyson Fury made it harder than anybody's business to get the fight done. So that may be the reason why someone just slid a bottom foundation from up under something that they were trying to build based on what we're hearing lately. That's why guys like Tyson Fury should just get out of the sport of boxing and let people handle it because I, you would think that that would be the fight that's happening. And we've heard that Anthony Joshua and Deontay Wilder is a fight that can at least happen despite not having Alexander Usyk and Tyson Fury. So it's very, it's, it's very frustrating. You know, it's very confusing. And I'm just scratching my head more at Skills Challenge because they're saying like, hey, this fight was never on, you know, and I'm like, okay, never on the, never on for December. So I'm like, okay, well, what were you talking about this whole time? You know, you're saying all these people are on board from talks, send these offers out. They're, so they're saying there's no offers sent out, but they're saying, you know, the fight is off. So I'm like, okay, well, that's stupid. You know, stop saying the fight is off. Just say what you mean. So if they mean the fight is off, that means that they haven't came to a conclusion or the deal can't get made possibly between or because of the promoters and the networks. So just say that, not saying, you know, um, uh, 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 well, it might not be made, you know, uh, or can't, but the best fights can't be made, like generalizing it, like the best fights can't be made because of these things. Let's just say this fight, okay? Because if it's this fight, say this fight, but don't give us a bunch of BS. But anyway, you guys tell me what you think of this article that's stating that Deontay Wilder versus Anthony Joshua is off 
and never on for December. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys been Counterpunch. Peace.